the U.S. announced more sanctions against Russia just one day before the summit. It added Chinese companies that were linked to Putin's war efforts, with President Biden coming out to condemn China for its continued support and for financing of Russia's invasion of Ukraine. President Lai, how does this impact the equation with Ukraine and Russia? I think definitely that the U.S. is putting more sanction on Chinese, especially uh, whether that is the military direct, directly related company or the dual use and companies. But I think that also sent out a signal that um, the direction um, on uh, to ask for the accountability of Chinese uh, role in the war in Ukraine, uh, that also becomes more apparent. Uh, especially in the Shangri-La dialogue where the Zelensky, the Ukraine President Zelensky, uh, has a last uh, minute effort and making himself into the, uh, in Singapore uh, to be the, the very last speaker of the sessions. But uh, in that session, he sort of uh, came out lambasted against the, uh, the China. And you were actually there. Yeah, I was there. Uh, I, I was there, yes. Um, and the, uh, I can see that the, uh, the disappointment uh, feeling expressed by the, uh, President Zelensky himself, uh, not only he did not meet with the, the Chinese Defense Minister Dong Jun, uh, and uh, he also uh, came out and said that the China was trying to help uh, Russia to discourage the country in the Asia Pacific not to participate in the Switzerland the Peace Summit, in which uh, Ukraine believed that the whole world needed to come together to find out uh, yeah, common positions and um, uh, to convince Russia that they need to come to terms with Ukraine. But China apparently not only itself did not uh, publicly say that the, uh, China would not participate, but China also uh, helped Russia by discouraging other countries uh, from not going to participate. And um, uh, Chinese effort uh, paid up to a certain extent, uh, but, and that also uh, decreased uh, the um, convincing power uh, of the uh, Switzerland Peace Summit. So Zelensky uh, wasn't very pleased, and uh, he was apparently very disappointed.